Ryan Marciniak's back, Astronomy in Action, uh, my buddy today for Eclipse Day. I was thinking one of the great lines I read from a NASA scientist is a solar eclipse, total solar eclipse, is a dance with three partners, the Earth, the Moon, and the Sun. Give us a, an Astronomy 101 primer here. What happens during a total solar eclipse? Absolutely. Well, first of all, it's my favorite word in the English language, a syzygy. S Y Z Y G Y, all three three bodies aligning in the solar system. Now it works because the moon and the sun, although they're not the same size, the moon is 400 times narrower than the sun, but also 400 times closer. And it's that cosmic coincidence that allows the moon to completely cover up the sun while still preserving the beautiful corona and solar prominences that come off of the sun. Now that's one piece. The second piece is that if the, the sun and the moon were always aligned in their orbits, we would get a solar eclipse every time there's a new moon. But because the tilt of the moon's orbit is about five degrees, usually when the new moon happens at the start of the month, the moon will pass above or below the sun. So you need that second coincidence of them lining up perfectly. And that usually happens once every 18 months. And then finally, you have to hope that it's over land. Earth is 70% oceans. And so we need that beautiful eclipse right. to line Even up. though they're happening once every 18 months, most times on the ocean. Yeah. So we don't even know. When we talk about rarity, I think the number is 375 years on average for a total solar eclipse over the same spot of land. Mm -hmm. It's most unusual mm -hmm. and part of the reason why we're celebrating it today. Listen, thank you for everything. You're going to take a little break and look after some other duties. You're going to send another of your, your colleagues to join me? Absolutely. Daniel is, is smart. He's, he's a, a wonderful speaker. You're going to love him. I'm going to love him too, but I have enjoyed my time. Come on back later today. We'll have more to. conversations. Astronomy in action, a big part of the puzzle here. Thank you very much.